Hi, I'm Robert, and this is my testimony. Uh, I'm gonna start when I was a young. I know all about hopelessness. Ever since uh, I was born, I've been abandoned, neglected, abused. I've been molested. Uh, just no hope. I had no guidance. I lived with a mother that was neglectful, she was addicted to gambling, so therefore I was all alone a lot of times growing up at a very early age. <laughs> I might get choked up. But uh, and then with that, growing up, you start to get hate in your heart and loneliness and despair and that leads you to do things that you normally wouldn't do. Uh, it led me to addiction, to pornography, lust after the flesh, alcoholism. I had many addictions. At the lowest point in my life, I was addicted to crack cocaine. But hallelujah, I was lifted out, lifted out of that by my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I want to give you some scripture, starting with Revelation 12, 11. This is why the testimony is given. And, 11, and they overcame him by the blood of the lamb and by the word of our testimony, and they loved not their lives unto death. Overcome who? The devil, the father of lies, who had blinded me in order to keep me captive to this world and separate me from God. But the truth, Jesus Christ, hallelujah, has set me free. In John 8, 32, you will know the truth and the truth shall set you free, hallelujah. I wanna let you know there's nothing that you're going through or have gone through or will go through that you will not find a way of escape through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. In Deuteronomy 31, 6, be strong and courageous. Don't tremble, don't be afraid of them. The Lord your God is the one who goes with you. He won't abandon you nor leave you. At, one, at the last point in my life, I had got, gotten fired, uh, about lost my life in a truck accident, drinking and driving on the way home. Uh, I just was in despair. So the Lord sent me to a church, a small church, and I learned about the Holy Ghost. And that's why it's important for the church to be in church, because when you're weak, you can become strong through the Word of God and through others who are in the same boat as you. I decided to give my Lord, life over to the Lord. I said, Lord, I can't take it no more. I need you to lead me, I need you to guide me. So what I did is I gave 120% to him, holding nothing back. In John 16, he says, these things I have spoken unto you, that in me you might have peace. In the world you have tribulation, but be of good cheer, hallelujah. I have overcome the world. We overcome through Jesus Christ, and we need to give all. I want to leave you with this. What is freedom but release from captivity, confinement, or slavery? If you're still captive, there's something you need to let go, and it's through the blood of the Lamb and the word of our testimony that we overcome this.